let's talk about the expression for bandwidth for example I got a two coherent sources separated by a distance d with a wavelength lambda a screen xy is placed parallel to ab at a distance of d from the coherent sources and c is the midpoint of ab o is the distance a point equidistant from a and b and p is the point at a distance x from o as depicted here waves from a and b meet such p in phase or out of phase depending upon the path difference between the two waves you are able to see this doesn't have the phase change phase uniformity over here we got the uniformity here so this is called constructor and this one is destructive I am trying to draw AM perpendicular to BP the path difference delta is equal to BP minus AP so AP is equal to AP is equal to MP so I am trying to use AP is equal to MP in the above equation you will get BP minus MP B P minus MP which is your BM So delta is equal to BM. In right angle triangle A, B and M. So BM is equal to D sin theta. If theta is small, sin theta will become 0. The path difference become delta is equal to theta into D. For the right angle triangle C, O and P you will be getting OP opposite side by adjacent side that is CO which is X divided by D for small values of theta you will be getting tan theta at 0 I think tan theta will become theta here so the path difference is given by the delta is equal to x into d divided by d so I am trying to, trying to substitute theta is equal to x by divided by d here so x into d divided by d that is delta now we will talk about the bright fringes by the principle of interference, the condition for the constructive interference is a path difference, which is nothing but n lambda. As you know, xd divided by d is equal to n lambda, where n is equal to 0, 1, 2 indicate that the order of bright fringes. So x is equal to n lambda divided by capital D divided by small d. This equation gives the distance of the nth bright fringe from the point O. If we talk about the dark fringes, by the principle of interference, the construction for destructive interference is a path difference as 2n minus 1 lambda divided by 2. So where n is equal to 1, 2, 3 indicate the order of the dark fringes. This equation gives the distance of the nth dark ring or dark fringes from the point O. Thus on the screen, alternative dark and bright bands are seen on either side of the central bright band. The distance between any two consecutive bright and dark bands is called as bandwidth. The distance between n plus 1 and nth order consecutive bright fringes from O is given by x of n plus 1 minus xn is equal to d by d of n plus 1 into lambda minus d by d of n lambda will be getting finally as 
d by d lambda so bandwidth is equal to d by d lambda it can be proved that the distance between two considered dark band is also equal to d by d lambda since bright and dark fringes are of same width they are equally spaced on either side of central maximum